Hey guys, welcome back to Lumber Capital Log Yard. This is day four of our work week. So we're not working today because it is pouring, but that doesn't stop Jade and Judah from deciding to go on a bike ride. I am going to go on a delivery with my dad though. Uh, he's training me how to go on the deliveries and not <laughs> mess up and wreck the truck or whatever because there's so much to think about, especially in the winter. It's really difficult uh, to get into driveways and stuff, so uh, he's, he's going to go on this one with me. to do our deliveries on rain days when there's nothing else really to do and you can sit in a nice heated vehicle and stay dry of course it doesn't always work out that way but today we have been doing uh, delivery after delivery so that ended up working out Sammy uh, cut down the hatchet house boards and then the, the delivery for them is tonight uh, but other than that there's not a lot going on because it's raining and we don't like to stand out in the rain even though sometimes it's necessary <laughs> because the ground is so cold but the air is so warm it's making it very foggy out so not maybe the best for driving but uh, we, we can manage it's very foggy though <laughs> I just have to wait for the boss to load up the uh, truck again and then we'll be off. So we call this the skeleton bucket. You really like using the skeleton bucket because when you scoop firewood it allows all of that debris to kind of just fall out and it just makes it so when you dump it you know there's less of a mess. And so it's a really nice investment. Uh, we use it all the time. I swear we use that thing more than the actual bucket. Uh, so for all of you people out there with, with tractors, you might want to think about investing in a skeleton bucket. I would not want to be him pulling into a gas station like this. He just barely made, made it. 